I met this guy in the street today, and, and many of you know me from, from my rants on, on Facebook, and, and I'm going to remain very non-political tonight, but, but I agree with the majority of what I feel uh, the sentiments of this gentleman who I met in the street said, what, what his things are. I think we just should re remain consistent and, and at very least continue occupying here locally. And, and we see it happening abroad. This is happening. And regardless of, of the differences we have as people, I've seen a lot of negative change over my lifespan. I'm, I'm a 44-year-old guy. I, I've seen, I came from a small town, and I've, I've seen this country really, really take a nosedive. I think it's good to talk about what we can do, and that's why I had this party. It was to join this group of people, whoever would show up here together, just so we remember, like, we're all human, and, and, and much of the investment and, and culture that, that pervades is, is geared towards separating us. Uh, you know, is your girlfriend pretty enough? Is your car fast enough? Is your house big enough? I, I think in, in the last couple generations I've noticed some people are like, I don't really fucking care how big my house is. I don't really care as long as my car gets me from here to there. It's fucking good enough. And I think we need to think like that and just not be yeah. greedy. And, and vote, vote or don't vote with your dollar. One of the things I've done, I burned wood. I don't give the oil companies my money. I, 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 I'm very critical and I speak critically all the time. And I have lots of stories if you ever want to hear some crazy fucking stories about oppression. <laughs> had federal agents in my shit when I wasn't there because I was teaching a lot of students political discourse similar to what's going on here. Ten years ago, I was predicting we're going to fucking take over Iraq. We're going to have, I had, you know, 28 dull-eyed students looking at me and three of them, like this guy and that guy and these guys, saying, I think Fred's right, but 28 people disagreed. And they were very vocal, and they disagreed. Well, here we fucking are. You know, we're an imperialistic force, and there's a karma associated with that. Period. End of story. So, Anybody else want to rant for a minute? I think we have one poetry reader. I'm going to let him read poetry. I want to rant. <laughs>